all right guys welcome to another video in this video i want to show you how to adjust your wiper height let's say in some circumstances this wiper for some reason does not reach the base of your so at times we have this scenario where this wiper this wiper is not reaching the base of the printer head that is not reaching the face of the printer head so that's what we mean by wiper height at times it's just very low i'm going to show you what i mean in a second but just watch it uh, i'm going to readjust this thing now so that by the time the printer head goes it will not touch this piece so if you have that kind of problem this is how you fix it so you come to here you press enter then you go here uh, setup menu you press enter on setup menu and then you go all the way down to uh, station setup you select station setup and then you go scroll down till you see wiper height so that's the dude there if you press wiper height everything is going to be set to default right so this is what i meant that when you're passing you see the, the the cable the blue this thing is not touching the printer head right have you seen it so how you fix that is by coming to this place and then you press up button as you're pressing the up button i want you to notice what's happening to the cap can you see it's going up right if it's too up you can always bring it down right it's too up you can always bring it down and then when you're happy with it you press enter and when you press enter then you cancel and then you can then go to maintenance now and then do clean nozzle to see whether what you said has worked properly so if by the time you're done uh, the cap is now in the position that you want then so the ideal situation is that the cap should go up and wipe the face can you see that so that's how to set your wiper height now next to this i'm going to show you how to set station position so let's say for instance while this thing is dripping now it's not dripping inside that cap in this case now you can see it's dripping into the cap and the printer head and the cap are aligned but there are situations where you know people have called me or sent me messages on whatsapp on this subject and then the printer is like this right it's not sitting properly on top of the cap so this is how you fix that type of problem so you come again to this place here you can exit this screen now there you go to press enter you press setup menu then you go to station setup and then you go to station position so station position is talking about this station position so if you press enter on station position you can see that now you will now come to this place. You can see that it's telling you you have options for left or right for the carriage. So the car there is the carriage. So left or right. If you press the left button, then this guy will go all the way down. If you press the right button, this guy will go all the way to the back. So you can then use that motion to set the position you want it to be. Right? Relative to the car. The most ideal situation is when the cap the most ideal situation is when the the printer head is flush, sitting flushed against the cap right so when you're happy with the position like that you then press again you press enter right and then you exit right and then again to test whether what you did was fine you come to maintenance and then clean nozzle and then the machine will go clean nozzle can you see that the cap is seated flush on top of the cap 
So that's pretty much how to fix those two problems. If you have similar problems, as long as you can read in English, or if you don't read English, you can ask your Chinese supplier. If your machine is not in English, you can ask your Chinese supplier to tell you how to change the language of your machine to English. But I actually do have a video in my channel that shows you how to convert to English. Now you can see that the cap, uh, the printer head is pouring directly into that cap and not outside of the cap. So that's pretty much how to fix those two problems. I hope that has helped somebody. If it has helped you, I want you to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, turn on the notification bell, and I'll see you in another video. Bye. Take care.